So it is going to another lane. I'm not liking this one. I already decided that car was like so pissed. That car was throwing like, why? What do you have like, what are you doing? For some reason, the car decided to change the lane one more time, which we don't need to do because I failed it. Again, one more time, wrong lane choose. My concern is if the car can do it so many times, why can't it do it every time and it just stopped here it decided to stop here probably because hello everyone we are back with another full self-driving video and uh, as you guys can see the car is getting out for the first time from my parking lot which is very very good so let's see how the car performs here uh so we're gonna make a right turn we're gonna do a few tests today's video we're gonna do some unprotected left and some U-turn and we're definitely gonna test another thing where the car always makes mistake where the car changed the lane at the very last moment and sometimes it failed to change the lane and navigate us on our route. So let's see how the car handles this one. So after this car on our left, we can proceed. So the car is proceeding, very nice. So let's see, right guys? Also guys, if you are first time watching this content, I request you please subscribe to our channel because in this channel, we're gonna talk about full self-driving, we're gonna talk about Tesla FSD and stuff like that. So we'll see how the car handles this one. And there is some construction going on. The car avoided that by going and changing the lane. But for some reason, the car decided to change the lane one more time which we don't need to do because we are gonna follow this route and we have to make a left turn in upcoming stop sign. So for some reason, I, I'm not sure why the car decided to change the lane at the very last moment. Now we need to change the lane to follow the route. So we'll see how the car handles this one. There is a car on our left side and let's see how the car handles this one. The car just passed us and we need to change the lane at least now. Now, yes, this is the time you should change the lane. So it is, you'll see the stop sign here. We should navigate. I'm just gonna scroll. We should go over there, but for some reason, the car failed it. Again, one more time, wrong lane choose. The reason for failing here is choosing the wrong lane. So I have to put it out there because the first time it did it so many times in this exact road perfectly and it failed so many times in this exact road so many times. I'm not sure why that car was standing. Okay, let's see how the car handles this left turn. We have to definitely wait and see how the car handles this left turn. So as I was saying, in this exact left situation or merging situation, our car failed so many times. And also it did it so many times. So my concern is if the car can do it so many times, why can't it do it every time? Why can't the car navigate us on that exact road every single time? So we're gonna make a left here and immediately we're gonna make a right. So this is the new thing guys, right? Again, this is the car is going super close to that fence making that left turn for some reason. Um, it just braked as you guys can see 11 and now it increased the speed. Not sure why it is doing it. It seems like it's very confusing today. And uh, let's make it, right? We're gonna make a right turn here and we'll see. And it just stopped here. It decided to stop here probably because it thought that we're gonna go and stop here. So I'm gonna take over. Why I'm taking over? Because I wanna try a new road where the car failed to make a left turn almost. Uh, so let's just read out it right now. So. What I will do is en route, house, and turning on. So it is going to another lane. I'm not liking this one. I'm gonna go here and then turn on the navigation. Let's see how the car handles this one. As you guys can see, there are some human in the road. The car avoided that. We are gonna make a left here where the car always goes so close. To the okay at the very last moment at the very last moment at the very last moment it fixed itself 
and going super close to that uh, fence and going a little fast to my test as you guys can see another car is approaching and the car is doing like left right left right not not liking it not not like for some reason i'm not liking this um like you know attitude of the car where the car is like adjusting the position so many times but it could just in the very first place it knows this road is narrow what it should do is going slow and cautiously right guys so we'll see how the car handles this one and we're gonna go there is a uh, cyclist bicyclist and we're gonna see if the car give a little a space yes it does and now it is proceeding very nice one more thing if you guys are not noticing that car is coming so we are gonna merge into that road but i definitely have to see if the car stops enough to look on its left side and then proceed because sometimes it proceed when there is other cars coming so right now you shouldn't proceed because there are others car so we'll see how the car handles this one now it decided to not going and now it decided that car was like so pissed that car was throwing like why what do you have like do, what you are doing like not even liking this um thing so much so i'm gonna take over now why i'm taking over because i'm gonna try that exact route where the car always makes mistakes so we will make a right turn here and then we're gonna do unprotected left turn so we'll see how the car handles this situation i'm making this right and then i'm gonna make a u-turn here as you guys can see and we'll find out how the car handle this situation thank you for watching guys the car is for some reason doing so many mistake um not pretty sure why it is making this kind of um decision making but in this exact road i just have to put it out there that in this exact road the car came so many times like not even once like so many times so we're gonna test it one more time So I'm going to do is make an unprotected left. So I'll put it out there. So let's see. So we'll make a left. The car's navigation is showing that we have to make a U-turn. But no, we can go straight and make a left. So the car just slows down one more time. Um, I'm, I'm just like very confused why the car is doing all these things while it could just go as straight go straight make a right and then you uh, turn so we'll see how the car handles this one i just make that person so pissed when that car was coming at the very last moment and it is now creeping we should uh, move after this car nice job there so we'll see how the car handles this one so we will go and make a u-turn so the car almost stopped okay making that you turn very slowly if there is any other car from our back the car will just hit that so fast because this lane is super fast and almost hit a red light almost the light just changed we slows down and then it's we decided to proceed so not pretty sure why we're doing everything wrong today so what i'll do i'll make another u-turn one more time and we'll find out how the car handles this situation so let's see All right guys i'll make another u-turn go on that exact location and tell the car to make a u-turn and we'll find out how the car handle it let's see um so if you guys are new in this channel guys please i'm trying so many things on fsd and we'll try um more things in future but we're gonna try u-turn now and unprotected left and we'll see how the car handles this one. Okay, just made that U turn, and now we are gonna go in that exact road and we'll tell the car, please navigate. You see that uh, black car? This is where we should stand and then make that U-turn. But for some reason, the car stays straight, not in that black side, uh, black, like that black car. 
so that's my concern like why would you do that when you can just you know like go straight and go make a right and then stay on that lane and then make a u-turn uh, when it's possible but let's see if the car can handle this one so we're gonna do one more time one more time one more time let's see guys how the car handles this one turning on fsd right now so let's see just turned on so as a human driver i would just go straight and march in this lane and then go over there to make a u-turn but for some reason our car is so slow to make a u-turn now it is clear all the way it should just make that u-turn fast so the decision making is way 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 bad and now it decided you see it was almost hitting that red so I just took over, not a good good sign, not a very good sign. So we'll make another U-turn, we'll try one more time. Last time, guys. We're gonna try one more time and we'll see how the car handles this situation. So I will try one more time. by making a U-turn and going over there. So please stay with me, bear with me. So I'll make a U-turn right now if there is no other car. So I'm just making it right now, so we'll see um how we handle this situation so the navigation is all over the place the car is trying to make a u-turn and then it failed first time it was very slow second time it failed completely where there is no other car but for some reason it went so far and then it decided to fail and almost hit a red car so not sure like what the car is trying to do so we're gonna try one more time and this will be our last time so let's see if the car can handle this one so as you guys can see the navigation is saying u-turn but our car should proceed so i'm gonna just press that acceleration a little bit so to tell the car you should just cross it as you guys can see it is showing right now to make a u-turn from there but we'll see how the car handles this one went a little fast uh in this narrow road i'm i'm not liking the fast going things because okay it is probably super close to that okay there is a car you shouldn't cross it right now there are two cars and you shouldn't cross it so what after this car moves we should just go over there and now it failed one more time so now it is showing in the gps that we're gonna make a u-turn from here so it will be so hard so we'll we'll wait until there is any other car so let's see if the car can make it so probably will not make it and it is making it so and it is slow and gone very good it made that mistake but it fixed itself which is the right thing to do uh, but i'm definitely gonna put out there that it was very 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 slow and dangerous it did it perfectly but it was so dangerous it was so 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 dangerous i have to put it out there guys because when it was making that u-turn there was another car coming from our backside right and the problem is when you are making a u-turn you should move fast so that the other cars who is coming so fast can get a space right so that you can just make that u-turn and proceed but for some reason our car decided to make that u-turn very slow but it did it without any intervention or any input from a human so i'm hopeful i'm still hopeful that this will be fixed first time very slow u-turn second time failed completely almost hit a red red car and third time 
fail to navigate but reroute us with a u-turn perfectly slow u-turn though thank you for watching guys what do you think about this video make sure you comment below and let me know what do you think about this video and fsd performance thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful wonderful day